Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today we will solve exercise 72a. Number one. Number one says three minus five. So when we subtract smaller number from the larger number, we have to bring a negative sign. That means three minus five should be minus two. Or we can say in that way, three has positive sign, five has negative sign. So if there are two different type of sign, that means we have to subtract. If we have same sign, that means we have to add. So three minus five, that is two. And what is the sign of the larger number? That is minus. So for that reason, the answer should be minus two. Number two. Similarly, we have to subtract seven minus four at false, that is three. And what is the bigger number sign? That is minus. So I have to give a negative sign. Number three, seven minus five. Look, the sign of seven and then sign of five, both are different. For that reason, we have to subtract. Seven minus five, that should be two. Number four, number four says two minus five. Two minus five, equal to actually we can say minus three. Now number five, number five says minus three minus four. Look, the sign of three and sign of four, both are same, both are negative. For that reason, we have to add this number. Three plus four, that is seven. And what is the symbol of three and four? That is negative. For that reason, we have to put a negative sign at the result. Number six, number six is three minus minus five, three minus minus five. That is three minus into minus, that is plus. Minus into minus, that is plus. So what is three plus five? That is eight. Very simple. Seven. Four minus minus seven. So four minus into minus, that is plus seven. Four plus seven, that is eleven. Now eight. Eight is minus four minus minus seven. So minus four minus into minus, that is plus seven. So minus four plus seven should be three. Why? Because the sign of the larger number is plus or positive for we have to give a positive sign and the answer. Number nine. Number nine says minus three minus minus six. So here minus three minus into minus that is plus six. Minus three plus six, so the answer should be three because sine of six and sine of three both are different. For the decision, we have to do the subtraction. Then we will put the sign of the larger number that is positive sign. For that reason, we have to give a positive sign. Now number 10. Number 10 says zero minus minus eight. That means zero minus into minus that is plus eight, that is eight. 11, 1.2 minus 2.3. So we have to subtract 1.2 from 2.3 at first. So that will be three minus two, that is one, two minus one, that is one, 1.1. 1 .1. So the answer should be 1.1. 1 .1. But look, what is the sign of the larger number? That is negative sign. For this reason, we have to put a negative sign at the result. 12, 3.4 minus 7.6. At first, subtracts 3.4 from 7.6. That will be, you know, six minus four, that is two, seven minus three, that is four. So answer is 4.2. But look at the sign of the larger number. Sign of the larger number is negative. For that reason, we have to put a negative sign at the result. So minus 4.2 will be the answer of number 12. Now number 13. Number 13 says 8.3 minus 4.5. We have to subtract 4.5 from 8.3. So if we subtract 4.5 from 8.3, we can say five, that is, it should be eight. One will be there, five, eight minus five, that is three. So that should be 3.8. And what is the sign of the larger number? That is positive because sine of 8.3 is positive. Sine of 8.3 is positive for that reason, the answer should be the positive. 7.7 .7 plus minus 6.6. .6. So 7.7 .7 plus into minus, that is minus 6.6. .6. So answer should be 1.1. Very simple. Number 15. Number 15 says 6.2 plus 
minus 7.4. Now 6.2 plus into minus, that is minus 7.4. So at first we have to subtract 6.2 from 7.4. So if we subtract, then we'll get 4 minus 2, that is 2, 7 minus 6, that is 1. So answer should be 1.2. But what is the sign of the larger number? That is negative sign, Cartesian. We have to put a negative sign at the result. Now, number 16. Number 16 says minus 5.3 minus 6.2. So look, the sign of 5.3 and the sign of 6.2 both are same. For that reason, we have to add these two numbers. So 5.3 plus 6.2 should be 3 plus 2, that is 5. 5 plus 6, that is 11, 11.5. And what will be the symbol? Symbol should be negative. Now 17. 17 says 2.4 minus 6.7. So at first, we have to subtract 2.4 from 6.7. So 7 minus 4, that is 3. 6 minus 2, that is 4. So answer is 4.3. And what is the symbol of the larger number? That is negative. For that reason, we have to put a negative sign at the result. 18. 18 says 3.5 minus 7.8. So in that problem, we have to subtract 3.5 from 7.8. So 8 minus 5, that is 3. 7 minus 3, that is 4. So answer should be 4.3. What will be the sign? Sign will be the largest number sign that is negative sign. So answer should be minus 4.3. Now number 19. 19 says one whole two by three minus two whole so one by three. So at first we have to convert this mixed fraction into improper fraction. Actually we have to convert this mixed number into improper. That means you know three one to three plus two that is five minus three to the six plus one that is seven. In both fraction, 3 is the denominator, so we have to put 3 here, and at numerator, we have to give 5 minus 7, that is minus 2 by 3, and that is the answer of number 19. Now, number 20. Number 20 says 3 whole 3 by 4 minus 5 whole 1 by 4. So look, 4 3 is 12 plus 3, that is 15, minus 4 5 is 20 plus 1, that is 21. So 4 will be our LCM and 4 will be our denominator also. So at numerator, we can write 15 minus 21. So what is 15 minus 21? That is minus 6 by 4. So if we want to reduce this fraction, then we can divide numerator and denominator both by 2. Then we'll get minus 3 by 2. If we want to convert this improper fraction into mixed number, then our answer should be minus 1 whole 1 by 2 because we know 3 divided by 2 that is 2 on the 2 so 1 will be left so this one will be here this one will be here and this 2 will be here so you can link this q and r in that way uh, if you want if you want to convert this one into uh, mixed fraction that is you know that should be q whole r by d R means roof, so it will be on upper side. D means down, so it will be on downside. Okay, that means quotient whole remainder divided by division. Now 21. 21 says 4x minus x. 4x minus x that is thrice x. Number 22. Minus 4x minus x. Look, the symbol of 4x and x both are same, so we have to add. That means 4x plus x that is 5x. And what will be our symbol? Symbol should be negative because 4x and x both has negative sign. For that reason, the answer should be the negative. Number 23. 23 says x minus 4x. x minus 4x should be minus thrice x. Why? Because there are two symbols. One is the symbol of x is plus. The symbol of 4x is minus. So if the both signs are different, that means we have to subtract. And the sign of the larger number is negative. For that reason, we have to give negative sign at the result. Very simple one. 24. 24 says x plus minus 4x. So that should be x plus into minus, that is minus 4x. 
x minus 4x that should be minus thrice x. Actually, these 23 and 24 both are same. Now 25. 25 says y minus 2y minus 3y. Look, here 2y and 3y both has negative sign. That means the sign of 2y and 3y are same. For that reason, we have to add 2y and 3y. 2 plus 3, that is 5. So y minus 5y. Now look at this. The sign of y and 5y both are different. For that reason, we have to subtract. 1 minus 5, that is minus 4. So answer should be minus 4y. Because we have to give the sign of the larger number and answer. Very simple. 26. 26 is y plus 2y minus 5y. Look at the sign of y and 2y. Both are same. For that reason, we have to add y plus 2y. That should be 3y minus 5y. 3y minus 5y, that should be 2y. And what will be the sign here? Negative, because the sign of 5y is negative sign. For that reason, we have to give negative sign at the answer. Then 27. 27 says minus y minus 2y minus 3y. Look, every sign are same. Minus, minus, minus. That means we have to add 3 plus 2, 5. 5 plus 1, that is 6y. And what will be the symbol? Symbol should be the negative symbol. Very easy one. 28. 28 says minus y plus minus 2y. Look, minus y. Plus into minus, that is minus 2y. The sign of y and 2y, both are same, both are negative. That means we have to add y plus 2y, that is 3y. So answer should be minus 3y. Now, 29. 29 says, 2z plus minus 3z minus minus 3z. So 2z plus into minus that is minus 3z minus into minus that is plus 3z. So if we see both are same number and that has different sign, that means we can cut 3z and 3z. So answer should be 2z. Or if we want to solve it in that way too, look, here 2z and 3z both has same sign. That means we can add 2 plus 3, that is 5z. And that is negative 3z. So 5 minus 3, that is 2z. So you can solve it in that way too. Both are correct. Now 30. 30 says a minus 2b, a minus 2b minus a minus b. So a minus 2b minus into a minus b, that should be minus a plus b. So a minus a, we can cut a minus a because if we subtract a from a, it will be zero. And minus 2b plus b. So we can write in that way at first, it will be better because you are starting this chapter right now. So you can write in that way too. So we can cut these two because both are same thing. And minus 2b plus b should be minus b. 31 says, a minus a minus 2b. So that is, you know, a minus a minus into minus that is plus 2b. So we can subtract a and a. So answer should be 2b. Now 32. 32 says a plus b plus c minus a minus b minus c. Look, here a plus b plus c minus into a that is minus a minus into minus b that is plus b minus into minus c that is plus c because you have already know that plus into plus that is plus plus into minus that is minus minus into plus that is minus minus into minus that is plus if you multiply these two things you'll get this answer okay now look a minus a. We have to rearrange this one. Plus b plus b plus c plus c. A and a both will be gone. So b plus b that should be 2b. C plus c that should be 2c. And that will be our answer. Now 33. 33 says 3a plus b plus 3a 
minus p. So 3a plus b plus into 3a that is plus 3a plus into minus b that is minus p. So we can rearrange 3a plus 3a plus b minus b. So we can cut the same number b and b. So answer should be 6a. So 6a should be the answer of 33. Now 34. 34 says x minus y minus z. So there should be x minus into y that is minus y minus into minus z that is plus z. And that is the answer of number 34. Now 35. 35 says y plus x minus z. Very simple. Y plus into plus x that is plus x plus into minus z that is minus z. And that is the answer of 35. Now 36. 36 says y plus z y plus z plus y minus z. So y plus z plus y minus z should be in that way. You can write it in that way. y plus z plus y plus into minus z that is minus z. So y plus y plus z minus z. So we can add y and y. That should be 2y. We can subtract z and z. So that would be 0. So answer should be 2y. Very simple action. Now 37. 37 says uh, 3a minus 4b minus 2a minus 2a minus 5b. So 3a minus 4b minus into 2a that is minus 2a minus into minus 5b that should be plus 5b. So we can first rearrange the same thing 3a minus 2a minus 4b plus 5b. 3a minus 2a that should be only a and minus 4b plus 5b that should be plus b. Look both signs are different for that reason we have to subtract. Now 38. 38 says u minus v minus u minus 2v. So u minus v minus into u minus u minus into minus 2v that should be plus 2v. So u minus u minus v plus 2v. So we can subtract u and u and minus v plus 2v that should be plus v because the sign of 2v and v are different for that region we have to subtract and the sign of the beacon number is plus so answer should be plus. Number 39. 39 says 2z, 2z minus x minus z minus x. So there should be 2z minus x minus into z minus x that is minus z plus x. So we can rearrange this one in that way 2z minus z minus x plus x. So we can subtract x and x because both are the same thing 2z minus z that is z. So answer should be only z. Now our last problem that is number 14. 40 says f plus 2g minus f plus g. So there should be f plus 2g minus into f plus g that is minus f minus into plus g that is minus g. So f minus f plus 2g minus g. So you can subtract the same number then 2g minus g that should be g and that is the answer of number 14. And that's all for exercise 72a. So thank you very much for watching the video. See you soon on next video. Until then, Allah Hafiz.